Self-regulation and volition. Separating the two components can be very confusing. Our goal is to provide examples to eliminate misconceptions. Here we're looking at a Venn diagram. In the diagram, we see that volition is a component within self-regulation. As the diagram shows, you can be self-regulated, but not encompass aspects of volition. Self-regulated students are active in their own learning. Their behavior, motivation, and thought processes determine their skill, performance, and academic goals. In this picture, all students are focused on writing a journal entry. There are no distractions in the classroom, thus making it much easier for them to be self-regulated learners. Here is another example of students in a focused learning environment. These students are also showing the characteristics of self-regulation. They are independently working on a study guide with the goal of passing a test tomorrow. They are on task and motivated to get their assignment finished so that they can do well on the upcoming test. Volition is one's ability to maintain focus and put forth an effort despite distractions. Some independent learners require little attention from their teachers and overcome outside barriers. These students have volition and can be described as self-regulated learners. In this picture, the student circle is staying on task while the students around him are involved in other activities. Despite the off-task behavior around him, he's employing volition to get his assignment completed. The student in the background, while showing self-regulation, is not employing volition. As you can tell by the frustration on his face, he is having difficulty staying focused due to the disruptive environment around him. Here is another example of a self-regulated student who is also showing volition. He is maintaining his focus despite the distractions of the environment around him. In conclusion, self-regulation and volition are two elements of motivation, where volition requires the learner to be able to focus despite distractions. If one has volition, they are self-regulated, but self-regulation does not necessarily give one volition.